in Indian culture, there's a story of Krishna. Krishna, who brought the Christ spirit. If you research it a little bit, there's argument about it. And there's Christ Christians who get all hot over it and protest, like, how dare anyone claim that anyone other than Jesus could bring the Christ spirit? But clearly he did. I have some comments by Martin Cecil. Krishna can be seen as providing a focus point in the dimensional world for those highest essences. I suppose from a different approach, we might say that here was the Christ, the word made flesh, the essences brought to a particular point of focus. But these essences are not something all on their own. As we have already noted, that this substance, this highest substance, is present through the whole universal creation, everywhere. If it is brought to focus at some point, that fact doesn't extract the essence from itself. If you've read the Bhagavad Gita, it's amazing what's portrayed of Krishna. Krishna is the charioteer, and he's with Arjuna, and he's inspiring Arjuna and encouraging Arjuna in his life. And at some point, Arjuna says to Krishna, uh, show me yourself, reveal yourself to me. And it's exquisite what's in the Bhagavad Gita about that revelation. And Arjuna is just overwhelmed. It's just so spectacular, so beautiful. And, and, and then he's, at some point he says, stop, 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 I've seen enough. It was so overwhelming. 